Number one says box A has a volume of 152 beans. If box B has a greater volume than box A, what could be said about the volume of box B? Choose the best answer. So we want a volume that's more than 152 beans. 25 is not more. 100 is not more. 125 is not more. 200 is more. So the best answer is the last one, which is 200 beans. Number two says, what is the area of a rectangle that is 2 and 1 fourth inch wide and 4 inches long? So I have to figure out the area. Since I have 1, 2, and 1 fourth right here, plus, again, another 2 and 1 fourth, plus another 2 and 1 fourth, plus 2 and 1 fourth, I know I can add them all together. Adding my whole numbers, 2 plus 2 plus 2 plus 2 is 8. Adding my fractions, my denominator is going to stay the same. Add my numerators. 1 plus 1 plus 1 plus 1 is 4. 4 fourths is the same thing as 1 whole. 8 plus 1 is 9. So our answer is 9 square inches. Number 3 says, which expressions are less than 16 minus 8? Circle all that apply. So we have 16 minus 8 in all of them, so we're looking at what comes after. The first one has multiplied by 2. We know if we multiply, our answer gets bigger, so therefore, that's not correct. 16 minus 8 minus 2, if we subtract 2, our answer is going to get smaller. So this one is correct. 16 minus 8 divided by 2, when we divide things, our answer also gets smaller. So that's correct. And the last one, 16 minus 8 plus 2, if we are adding things to it, our answer is getting bigger, so that is not correct. Number 4 says complete. 1 hour equals blank minutes. And I know 1 hour equals 60 minutes. So the next one says 3 and a half hours equals blank minutes. So 3 hours would be 3 times 60. 3 times 0 is 0, 3 times 6 is 18, so 180, plus we have this half hour, which we know is 30 minutes, 0 plus 0 is 0, 8 plus 3 is 11, carry the 1, 1 plus 1 is 2, our answer is 210 minutes. The next one says 3 fourths of an hour, or 3 quarters of an hour. In 1 quarter of an hour, we have 15 minutes. We have 3 quarters of an hour, so we have to do 15 times 3. 3 times 5 is 15. Carry the 1. 3 times 1 is 1. Plus 1 is 4. 45 minutes. The last one, blank hours equals 240 minutes. So again, I know there are 60 minutes in an hour, so I have to do 240 divided by 60. Since there are zeros in both, I can get rid of them. 6 goes into 24 four times, so my answer is four hours. Number five says write an expression for each statement. The first one says add 12 and 8 and multiply the sum by 3. So the very first thing I need to do is t add 12 and 8. Since I do that first, I can put parentheses around it. Then it wants me to multiply that by 3. It doesn't ask you to solve it, only ask for the expression, so you can leave that right there. The next one says subtract 10 from the product of 6 and 8. So the first thing I need to do is find the product of 6 and 8. Product means multiply. And then subtract 10. And again, you only need the expression. And the last one says, Josh has 10 goldfish and 2 guppies. Half of the fish are male. Write an expression that shows how many fish are female. So the first thing I need to do is find out how many fish there are, which means I need to add 10 plus 2. Since I do that first, we put parentheses around it. Half of them are male, which means the other half are female, which means we divide it by 2. Since it's only asking for the expression, you do not have to solve the problem.